It is done. Johnson is dead? No. He retreated when we destroyed the tea. Only to hatch some new scheme, I'm sure. You should have killed him. There was no need. Time will tell if you speak the truth. Radun Hagedum! Radun Hagedum! Ganondokon, why are you here? Has something happened? William Johnson has returned with all the money required to buy our land. He meets with the elders as we speak. I have begged him to resist, but I fear he shall have his way unless you intervene. How is this possible? We destroyed the tea. The Templars are nothing if not resourceful. You should have heeded my warning. Please, you have to stop him. Of course. Can you tell me where they are meeting? Alright, it's across the way. Reach the meeting hall atop the cliff. Let's go harness some William Johnson. Can I not just go all the way around over there, or is the game directing me to go down this way? Oh shit, I'm dead. Alright, I'm still alive. That was a big drop, you know. I'm surprised I'm still alive after that one. I really am. Alright, my health is regened. We got guards over there. We got two on the walk over there. So can I... We going up? Yeah, okay, I see where we're going. Let's go for a swim. I'm ready for this. Oh, <laughs> these people are dead meat. Shit, he's gonna fire at me if I don't get onto land quick. He's dead. Right. Connie's just gonna beast out now. He's gonna take out everyone one by one. Shit, man. This is brutal. This is epic! I'm gonna take these two out as well down here. They're not gonna live. Things they've done. I love the music. Totally unaware. I can't. Shall we? Yeah. Uh, shall we get the bow for this one? Shit! What are you doing, Connor? Let's go for stupid grass. Oh, make short work. Yeah, I don't think so. And you're dead. Well done on the short work thing. And he's dead as well. <laughs> Look at this guy just casually walking down. Do 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 do. Oh my god, what's going on here? And I'm dead. Should be another one just above us, probably. I'm gonna walk. I'm gonna take it nice and slow. I'm gonna take in the surroundings. They don't even stand a chance. We are not your brother. I feel kind of sorry for them. You seek land to enough land that is not yours nor any person. Someone's talking up. Get into the bush, get into the bush. He's coming, he's coming, he's coming. How can he see me? I'm in the pine tree. Signing our lines over to you, then we'll be as one in your debt forever. Sir William may have a point. What hope have we against their black powder and iron? The spirits will guide us as they always have. Did they not guide us here? Yes. 
that we might unmask the great betrayer. This is a mistake we should sign. Who is that that's talking up there? Some of the guards? I'm gonna take this guy out next. He's gonna see the body of his friend, and then we're just gonna pounce on him. <laughs> that's pretty epic. Let's keep uh, let's keep moving up here. Alright, there's another one coming down here. I know we can probably take them out at the same time, but I mean, it's better, and it feels better to be taking them out one by one. Alright, here he comes. Somehow he can't see me hidden in the bushes here. Little does he know, all of his mates have been taken out down the, uh, down the hill. <laughs> hey, buddy. Stop, I tell you. Oh, look at his neck, man. Ooh, it just looks brutal. Alright, we're there now. Doesn't seem to be m much resistance here. Probably get up onto that platform there. Right, there's a shitload of them over there. This guy walking over here. Should we just get ourselves involved? Let's just do it. What's going on, guys? Let's go loud. Time to go loud. Right, they still don't know I'm here. Let's uh, let's get up onto the roof here. We'll get a nice view of the place. Side behind the chimney. Oh right, okay. There is a shitload of them here. Is that William Johnson? I can't can't make out. Shame can't. All right. Um. Let's just go down there and make ourselves known. Like a boss. Look all these tribes people. Peace! Peace! Have I not always been an advocate? Have I not always sought to protect you from harm? If you wish to protect us, then give us arms, muskets and horses that we might defend ourselves. War is not the answer. We remember, Stanwich. We remember you moved the borders. Even today, your men dig up the land, showing no regard for those who live upon it. Your words are honeyed, but false. We are not here to negotiate, nor to sell. We are here to tell you and yours to leave these lands. So be it. I offered you an olive branch, and you knocked it from my hand. Perhaps you'll respond better to the sword. Are you threatening us? Yes. I think it's pretty obvious, isn't it? That he's threatening them. Let's go! Let's do this! Oh shit, what the hell? William Johnson, the mine! Son! Oh. Where did he go? Like a pack of wolves, these guys! Ah, son of a... Oh, they're brutes! Oh, look how many there is! Need to regen! Do do do, where did William Johnson go? Oh, what's in there? He's running down the hill. I'm going after him. I don't care for the brutes. He's mine. Shit.
shit, come on. Connor, no! No! Fucking dick. You idiot, Connor. You idiot. Get down there, get down there, go, go, go. Let's get him. This guy's mine. Well, 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 what do we have here? Looks like he's given up. Time to meet your maker, William Johnson. I've done nothing. Mercy. Oh, no. What have you done? Ensured an end to your schemes. You sought to claim these lands for the Templars. Aye, that we might protect them. Do you think that good King George lies awake at night, hoping that no harm comes to his native subjects? Are that the people of the city care one whit about them? Oh, sure. The colonists are happy to trade when they need food or shelter or a bit of extra padding for their armies. But when the walls of the city constrict, when there's crops that need soil, when there's... When there's no more enemy to fight, we'll see how kind the people are then. The colonists have no quarrel with the Iroquois. Not yet, but they will. It is the way of the world. In time, they'll turn. I... I could have stopped it. I could have saved you all. You speak of salvation, but you were killing them. Aye, because they would not listen. And so, it seems, neither will you. Ayawas ne yate hagum sare, am dahya yu meskana zizagum haje. William Johnson is dead, and with him, the Templar plot to steal the land of my people. But in ending this threat, I have revealed another. On his body was a letter addressed to John Pitcairn containing orders to root out and destroy Patriot weapons and supplies. Should he succeed in this, the colonists will be unable to maintain their resistance, and the Templars will surely take control. So long as Pitcairn lives, the danger remains. I need to find him. He needs to die. I thought it might bring clarity or instill a sense of accomplishment, but all I feel is regret. Hold fast to that. Such sacrifices must never come lightly. I had to do it. Not only for my people, but for all the others Johnson would have harmed. It's a start. But to truly be free of Templar influence, all of them must be dealt with in turn. Even your father... I know. You speak the words, but do you believe them? Seems we've company. What is it? A request for aid from Paul Revere. Seems the Redcoats are up to something in Boston. Guess you made an impression on the Sons of Liberty. They mistake me for one of their own. Please, tell Mr. Revere he has my sympathies, but I cannot help at present. 
you might wish to reconsider. John Pitcairn is mentioned by name. Where am I to go? Mr. Revere's house in Boston. If you'd like, I can... <laughs> 